Although Hong Kong has seen much change, a staple that has lasted the test of time is the famous Hong Kong wonton. Vivian took me to Max Noodles, one of the first restaurants in the region to sell the popular dish. And what does wonton mean? Oh, wonton, okay, one means a cloud. Oh, one means a cloud, okay. Cloud. Tan means swallow. Swallow. So you swallow the cloud. Swallow the cloud, because it looks like a cloud. Yeah, it's like a cloud in the sky. <laughs> that makes sense. Like a cloud. So this place, I would imagine, through the week would be really busy because it's been here for so long. Oh, uh, yeah, and many people love to come here. Not only the, the people who work nearby, also some older generation. Yeah. Uh, they always been here. Um, whenever they think of, oh, I like wonton noodles, they like to come to this place. While Hong Kong is happy to embrace the new, another example of it happy to hold on to its heritage is the traditional Chinese tea ceremony. It's been practiced in the region for hundreds of years, and Maria is a passionate representative. Now I'll show you how to hold the teacups. Yes, please. Hold it with your thumb and the middle finger. Hold onto the rim. This? Very good. It's okay. Very clever. Then the fourth finger in the middle Ooh, to balance. That's getting tricky. There we go. So. Now learn how to drink, so we can do it together. Okay. The first sip. Sounds good. Just zip a little bit because sometimes it might be very hot. Hot, yes. Mm. Okay. Mm. Nice tasty. Very nice. Very nice. Okay. Second sip, two third of the whole cup, okay. and then let the, the tea zip into your gum. Okay. Last sip. My grandfather always reminds me to be good girl, not drinking like a cow. <laughs> so all in one sip. <laughs> Okay, mm. very, very large. Delicious. Shake, shake, shake. <laughs> if this tea leaf is good, all the smiles stay to the bottom of this cup. Right. So this is the very, very good thing.